The paintwork of the Honda Jazz slash Fit body, unlike European cars, is of very good quality and endures the hardship of everyday use. But the corrosion protection of metal cannot boast of such reliability. The red hair disease most quickly befalls the rear wheel arches, since there are no lockers that could protect them from stones, exposure to chemicals and other dirt from the road. If the lockers are not installed, in addition to the surfaces of the arches, the edges and seams will not be in the best condition. In advanced cases, everything can end with the appearance of holes, small and not very. The presence of lockers is not in all cases a guarantee that there is no problem, since they are of different quality, plus they are often installed crookedly and on screws, demanding the integrity of the metal protection. The situation is aggravated by the fact that when introducing a revision, few people think about ventilation of the cavity above the locker, but install it to simply close the holes in the body. Corrosion is often found on the back of the body, at the seams of the opening located just above the rear lights. The main reason for the appearance of rust here is condensation, which flows down the rear pillar from the roof. Plus, the seams of the roof are not tight enough and can let moisture through. It is worth noting that the presence of moisture in the luggage compartment can lead to the appearance of through corrosion. The trunk floor is also at risk, but here it is much easier to notice the problem and fix it. To protect yourself from possible problems, you need to periodically remove the casing and check the condition of the seams. It is not be superfluous to control the condition of the lower edge of the threshold under the plastic, the internal seams of the doors, the front edge of the hood, the area around the gas tank filler and the metal contacts with the door handles. On the bottom of the car is the presence of maintenance of significant pockets of rust. It should not be, although it is worth recognizing that the seams are prone to corrosion. Among other shortcomings, it is worth noting the weak front optics and fog lights, which are not famous for either the quality of lights or reliability. In the headlights, in addition to the weak protective plastic, it scratches. It is necessary to highlight the lamp connectors, which can melt during prolonged use. There are also complaints about the quality of the fastening of bumpers and rear view mirrors. It loosens up over time. On older specimens, the trapezium of the wipers require attention, the bushings break. It is also worth mentioning the door seals, which are of mediocre quality here. The Honda Jazz feed only naturally aspirated gasoline power units of the L-series were available – 1.2, 1.3, 1.4 and 1.5. The motors of this series are quite reliable and bother, as a rule, in small things. The most problematic place is the ignition module and IDSI spark plugs on 8-valve versions. Plus, it's difficult to change candles here, especially the back row. For easy access, you have to remove the intake or use a short candle range. If you neglect the regular replacement of candles and the prevention of tips, this will affect the dynamics of the motor and its stability. But all this is trifle, compared with the accelerated wear of the catalyst. In addition, the operation of candles in excess of the form negatively affects the resource of expensive ignition coils. Another problem area is the EGR valve, in which gaskets begin to leak over time and the valve itself begins to wedge, requires cleaning. In addition, the intake manifold is quickly clogged due to the fault of the EGR valve. It is worth noting that turning off the valve here is not as easy as on other cars. The ventilation system is also considered problematic, in which, in addition to a weak radiator, the pipes of the system often fail. They delaminate, corrode after 8-10 years of operation. Also, with increasing age, the wiring of the crankshaft position sensor DPKV, requires attention, especially if there are oil leaks from under the engine front cover. If oil gets on the wiring, the insulation is destroyed. It is necessary to replace that, in general, motors do not differ in their tightness and can drive oil through the camshaft plug, oil seals and all kinds of gaskets. Another disadvantage is a weak starter and battery, which are not always able to start the internal combustion engine in the cold season. Honda Jazz feed with a 1.2 and 1.3 liter engine L12A-A13A often has such a nuisance as air leakage through the throttle body. This ailment is manifested by unstable idling and for cars with a variator it also jerks its start. Of the operational shortcomings of the internal combustion engine, it is worth highlighting the need to adjust the valve clearances every 50,000 km and the dense layer of the engine compartment, which greatly complicates the maintenance of the unit. The resource of the piston group is more than 300,000 km. Despite this, most specimens with a millage of 200,000 plus have increased oil consumption. In our market, Honda Jazz Feed is found with three types of gearboxes, 5-speed manual and automatic transmission, as well as a CVT stepless variator. A manual gearbox does not cause any particular problems, with the exception of the box drive, which becomes loose over time. On older cars, you need to monitor the oil level, smudges appear. A clutch with a release bearing also has a good resource, about 150,000 km. The automatic shaft transmission, which was intended for the American market, is also reliable. It is worth noting that versions with a classic machine gun are very rare. You can get acquainted with the shortcomings of this KP in this article.
The mission has one drawback is common with the mechanics, the tendency to corrosion of tubular drives. The trouble is aggravated by the small diameter of the drive, which breaks off when damaged by rust. To protect yourself from possible problems, you need to remove paper stickers from the drives and carry out anti-corrosive treatment. The variator SLYA-SZCA does not bother with frequent breakdowns, which is equipped with a smart control unit that allows you to simulate gear changes and adapt to your driving style. Like other representatives of continuously variable transmissions, this variator is sensitive to the purity of the lubricant and operating conditions. It is recommended to change the oil every 40,000 km and avoid sudden starts, especially on a cold car. Frequent replacement of the lubricant is due to the fact that there is no torque converter and its functions are performed by the main clutch, which works quite hard. With proper maintenance, the clutch resource will be more than 200,000 km. Traditionally, the main reason for the complete failure of the variator is the wear of the belt and cones, but in the absence of sharp starts, they can last up to 300,000 km. Approximately the same amount of bearings are in valve body. Of the problem areas, one can single out a short service life of the starter pack and the left support, about 50,000 km, in the unsatisfactory condition of which jerks and vibrations appear. The chassis of the Honda Jazz Fit is endowed with a traditional suspension architecture for this class of car, McPherson struts in front and a beam in the back. Despite the low cost of the car, the suspension turned out to be quite strong and in the original versions can do without repair up to 150,000 km. The weak points of the chassis, in addition to the stabilizer consumables, include the supports of the front suspension struts, which are very sensitive to the quality of the road surface. If you do not slow down on bumps ahead of time, wheel bearings and silent blocks with rear axle shock absorber supports are handed over. It is worth noting that when using non-original spare parts, the suspension may require attention every 60-80,000 km. The steering system uses a rack and pinion mechanism with EUR. The rail is quite reliable, but do not happy with the gear ratio, which negatively affected the steering angels, and is especially acute on sharp turns. The situation is aggravated by the EUR, endowed with a Roth torque sensor and settings far from the driver's ones. The disadvantages include the unreliability of the control unit in the amplifier motor. However, due to the large gear ratio of the rack, most owners do not even notice the appearance of problems with the amplifier. But malfunctions of the steering shaft make themselves felt immediately, the steering column shaft begins to play. If you ignore the problem for a long time, the cardan shafts will begin to break. The brakes are also reliable, but given the age of the car, you need to be prepared for a planet rebuild of the calipers. Often there is corrosion on the fasteners of the pads in the rear brake drums, which leads to loosening of the pads and their displacement. If the owner ignores the presence of a problem, everything ends up replacing the drum and the entire filling, since a blown pad usually breaks everything inside the drum, including the brake cylinder. Interior Despite the status of a budget car, the Honda Jazz Fit interior is made of fairly high-quality finishing materials that remain in good condition for a long time. Another advantage of the car is a good interior design and the presence of a proprietary transformation system for the rear seats, which will allow you to carry oversized luggage. The disadvantages include poor sound insulation, rapid wear of the steering wheel rim and velar seat upholstery. The stove radiator can also be classified as problematic, which is often damaged not only during operation but also when installing abnormal music, alarms and when performing service work. As for the reliability of the Honda Jazz Fit selling equipment, most of the problems here are age-related and, as a rule, are caused by natural wear and tear. The first failures appear closer to 200,000 km. Basically, the malfunctions are caused by the unsatisfactory condition of the contact groups of various controls in the cabin and the wiring of the driver's door. Some owners consider the fuse box and the cell and wiring braid to be problematic, damage to which can lead to a short circuit, burnout of the tracks and even fire. Negatively affects the electronics and interference in the system of unskilled electricians. Another disadvantage is to write down the weak contact group of the ignition switch, and the lock itself sometimes wedges. Bottom line, despite its middle age, the Honda Jazz Fit is a good second-hand option, especially if the budget for buying a car is small. The advantages of the car include the reliability of most components and the original design, thanks to which it looks no worse than other representatives in the class, but at the same time more practical. If you are the owner of this car model, please describe the problems that you had to face during the operation of the car. Perhaps it is your review that will help readers of our site when choosing a car.